Hi again. We're very happy to see you still with us for more Explore Tulsa. Hey Trish, what kind of photos do turtles take? I give. What kind of photos do turtles take? Shelfies. Oh my god, I guess we'll find out for sure at the new sea turtle exhibit at the Oklahoma Aquarium. Well, all sea turtles are threatened or endangered, and so you don't really just wake up one day and say, let's have a sea turtle exhibit. They have to be animals that could not go back to the wild. So in 2004, we acquired two loggerhead sea turtles who were deemed unreleasable. They could not go back to the wild safely. So we knew we could possibly build an exhibit for them in the near future and had them in a behind the scenes space. So then the dream began to build an exhibit unlike anything else in Oklahoma and really unlike anything else in a lot of other aquariums because it's very bright and light and airy and open. So you really feel like you're not just in an inside exhibit, you're at the beach maybe, really seeing the sea turtles. Well, the turtles do not have names. Uh, they're both boys, they're both brothers, and so that's something that we'll work on for maybe a future contest to get the public involved. For right now, um, they're just the two big loggerhead sea turtles. But when you come into Sea Turtle Island, you start on the ground floor, where you see floor to ceiling view of the whole exhibit, and you see the sea turtles swimming. Along with them, we have bonnethead sharks and tropical fish, so it really is the whole ecosystem. When you come up to the second floor, you have this wonderful underwater observation station that kids and some adults can crawl into so they can see the turtles and the fish underwater. And you can also pop your head up in the acrylic bubble and look around and see them really close as they're swimming up. And there are some nice benches there for the adults and some of our older visitors to really rest and relax and enjoy the peaceful nature of it. Then up on the top floor, you get to see over the whole thing and we have Caribbean music playing, so it's just an experience. They're very social. They come up to the window and they look like they're saying hi to you. And so they're just really an engaging animal. And because they are endangered, I think people really are concerned about their welfare on the planet. And so that's part of it. But let's face it, turtles are just fun. Kids love them, adults love them. And this is a way that we can learn, even in inland Oklahoma, that our actions affect the ocean. There are seven species of sea turtles, and all seven are endangered. Loggerheads are found in temperate waters all over the world, but you can find them in U.S. waters around the coast of um, Florida, even as far north as Virginia, which is where our two came from. So you can find them in U.S. waters on the beach areas. I, I'm very proud of our people. When guests walk into the Oklahoma Aquarium, they're here to see the fish, the sharks, the sea turtles, but it is the staff and the volunteers who really make it happen. This was almost entirely built by our employees. That's something to be truly proud of, and that's something that we've been able to watch grow and evolve uh, since the aquarium opened in 2003. Like you said, I've been here a little over 10 years and I've just seen dynamic changes. There's always something new to see. Even if it's not as big as this exhibit, there may be a new animal, there may be one that's had babies. There's always something different and changing.